Um, so my name is Rebecca Welling and I'm currently working for IUCN in their water program. Okay, great. And uh, what exactly are you doing here at the Stockholm World Water Week? What brings well, you? Well, part of the junior professional program that I'm on at IUCN um, provides opportunities like this for the junior professionals to come along to. So it's also an opportunity for me to see everything and how it works. Um, but it's also an opportunity for me to get involved in the Six World Water Forum work. Um, I'm doing, uh, I'm supporting IUCN with coordinating one of the thematic priorities, 2.4, mm -hmm. on promoting green growth and ecosystems valuation. And uh, so it's an opportunity to come and meet with different people who are working on this, this target. Um, and so we're just having different meetings here and there, inside meetings, and trying to bring stakeholders together. Okay, and what, so what, I mean, you're on a young professional program, does that mean you just came out of a study? Or does no, it mean no, that no, you're no. Uh, an independent professional? Yeah, I was freelancing before. So okay. um, I came out of studies about three, four years ago, uh, my master's, and I've been freelancing since. Um, okay. And so to enter into IUCN, I've started on this program. But okay. it finishes in December. And, and what's the goal of the program? Um, well, it's to integrate into an organization and, um, and to learn about the programs and what we do. But the thing that I wanted to talk to you about was six on the forum, if that's okay. And just to say that... Well, um, yeah, okay. Just what can we look forward to in the six water forum? Well, what? I think the, the, the aim for us and uh, for, for Marseille next year is, um, is to try and, up until then, to get people on board. Uh, the important thing about uh, the work that's happening around the Six Hour Water Forum is trying to get as many people as we can to, uh, from different sectors, different areas, to try and put forward different solutions to the targets um, that have been outlined for promoting green growth. The targets are related to policies, technologies, sustainable financing, accounting, and... Um, well, so the Six Water Forum, uh, World Water Forum, is going to be a huge event. I mean, it's way bigger than, yeah. than the World Water Week in one way. On the other hand, it's a completely, in some ways, some audiences get drowned out. Have, have you experienced a water forum before? No, I haven't. This okay. Is, what, is, what is IUCN expecting to achieve at the Six Water Forum? And, uh, that's a big question. Yeah. It's, a, it's a big question, and IUCN are involved in different thematic priorities okay. as well. Let's the say for this... What, well, what for this one, the, the, the goal is to really find different solutions to the, to the five targets that are outlined underneath the core topic of, of green growth. Um, and and what is green growth, if you define it, really? Uh, now, that's another tricky question, because lots of people define it in different ways. But mm -hmm. the way we understand it is we're trying to link it explicitly to ecosystem services. Yeah. And within this priority, we're trying to see the role that ecosystem services can play in green growth and green economy as well trying to see how water relates to this and then trying to link it outside and try and spread this dialogue to other sectors and then also to other conferences such okay. as the Rio Plus 20 and the Bonn Conference before the Six of Water Forum. So you might use the World Water Forum to engage with private sector as well, I suppose? Well, I suppose, yeah. I mean, the idea is that the information that we get through all these work is not going to just stop at the Six World Water Forum. Yeah. The idea is to keep these target groups working um, and to have uh, much longer term um, uh, milestones so that more people get involved and, and dialogue increases on okay. these issues. Okay, great. Thanks. Okay, thank you.